दिस व्यवस्थित दृष्टि धारत राष्ट्र कभी ध्वजना प्रवृत्ते शस्त्र संपादे धनु उद्यम्य पांडव ओके दिस इज द देन व्हाट हैपेंस ऋषि केशम तदा वाक्यम इदम आहम हिपते सेन योर योर मध्ये रथम स्थापयमे अच्युता दिस इज द मोस्ट ब्यूटीफुल श्लोक हियर वेयर दीस टू श्लोकस विल गिव द कंप्लीट साइकोलॉजी ऑफ अर्जुन देव complete psychology of arjuna is enlisted there we have to unfold that what happened to arjuna dev see rishikesham tada vakyam he wanted to speak to krishna dev so what are all the words used by sanjay dev we should know athavya vastitam drishtva what happens there all these vyavastha that means all people kauravas and pandavas they have assembled there and they have that view her Sanya Vyuha. There is a technique to attack the counterparts. They make that the way how the soldiers stand and all the army animals that is like horse, elephants, everybody. How they make their Vyuha. That is called as Atham Vyavasthita. That Vyavastha means Vyavasthita means that the way how to tackle the opposing people. They are already gathered there. They had already plans how to attack the opposing people. They already that is called as atham yavastitam drishtva dharatarashtram. He Sanjay is giving the he is narrating no to Dutrashtra there what happened there what's happening what happened before the starting of the yuddha. Please tell me that was the question no the first question asked by them. Mama ka pandava astai va kimo kuru bato Sanjay that's what no the first shloka it says. So he is explaining atham yavastitam drishtva dharatarashtram. कपिध्वज प्रवृत्ते शस्त्र संपाते वॉट हेपन लिसनिंग टू ऑल दीज सघोष इवन अर्जुन गॉटअप एंड ही जस्ट टुक हिस बो एंड एरो धनु उद्यम्य पांडव सी द वर्ड सी पांडव ही गिव्स द वर्ड बिकॉज इन द फर्स्ट स्टोक काउंटिंगली आम का पांडवाश्चे कि so that means he separated himself his people that is duryodhana ji and pandavutra separate only duryodhana and other people company they are only my sons and the pandavutra they are not my people that is the psychology there of dhritarashtra so sanjay and you already when he heard the first conversation with dhritarashtra itself he came to know this type of differentiation is there in already in the mind of dhritarashtra there so that's why he says dhanurudyamya pandava to whom you are saying there mamaka pandava steva now that the same pandava that is madhyama pandava arjuna he got ready there so this is how he is giving back tit for tat sanjay is giving tit for tat to dhritarashtra this is a beautiful psychology hidden in this bhagavad gita shlokas the first 20 shlokas completely this psychology completely the people who are participating in the bad field the psychology is hidden there we have to unfold we have to open all those psychology and apply to our own lives there this is not we are all arjuna we are all like dhritarashtras we are all like dushasana duryodhana all qualities are there in us only that's why mahabharata is the greatest epic ever written by any authors on this earth na bhuto na bhavishyati it is like that na bhuto na bhavishyati it will never come in future also like ramayana mahabharata epics that is the only world famous epics many people have written so many puranas and so many things but like epics like this ramayana and mahabharata they are unparalleled it can never be repeated though so such is the character and such is the analysis psychoanalysis of human race that's what i keep shouting and i keep yelling to everyone so it is nothing but don't consider this ramayana mahabharata as one of the dharmak dharma granta just puja karne ke liye aarti aarti utarne ke liye on saraswati puja they do bhagavad gita aarti utarenge ramayana mahabharat ka matlab kabhi padhna usko padhenge bhi nahi no never never they will open the pages what is written inside that that is the greatest disaster in our life we all follow traditions culture everything just blindly we do that is it not that is not at all the demand of vedavyasa he did not write just to make arthi 
एंड अगरबत्ती लगा के उसको फूल लगाओ फूल चढ़ाओ बस इट्स नॉट फॉर दैट वे दे वी एस अ रोल ऑल दीज टू ऑल द ह्यूमन बीइंग्स दैट्स व्हाई ही सेज वन हु कैन नॉट स्टडी वेदास वन हु कैन नॉट स्टडी द स्क्रिप्चर्स इन द डेप्थ फॉर देम आई हैव आई एम राइटिंग दिस महाभारत स्त्री सूत्र ब्रह्म बंधुना त्रयी न श्रुति गोचरा there is a reason that's why i am writing this three na shruti gochara all the vedic wisdom they can't go into the depth they not everyone can study vedas and upanishads so for them to make them understand what is the philosophy and the essence of life is not separating people they so he is he wants to convey the depth of philosophy through mahabharata If you become expert or philosophically expert in Mahabharata, that's more than enough. That is the greatest wisdom. Vedic wisdom is hidden in that. That's why in Bhagavad Gita, the seven hundred shlokas, psychology, psychology, psychology. Yeah, each and every character is a psychological beautiful evidences there. So, Athapya Vasti Tam Dhritva Dharta Rashtram Kapit Vaja. See, this word Kapit Vaja is written here. You should know the background here. Why it is written as Kapit Dhaja? Kapit Dhaja means in a flag where Hanuman is there. So in the chariot of Arjuna, where Krishna is also there, there is a flag. Flag on the flag, the emblem of Hanuman is there. So that's why it is the only chariot who had the emblem of Hanuman there. So then, what is the significance of Hanuman? significant sir hanuman everybody knows that wherever there is hanuman there is no question of defeat at all buddhir balam yasho dhairyam nirbhayatvam arogata ajadhyam vakpatatvancha hanumat smaranat bhave hanuman ka smaran karte hi ye sab mil jata hai so that is the reason why hanuman is there on the flag of arjuna the chariot that on the chariot of arjuna धारतराष्ट्रां कपित दुजा। He is making धृतराष्ट्रां to know each and everything. That means he should have come to conclusion. Oh, मेरे बेटे सब खोने वाले ये सब युद्ध। So that is the warning he is giving there. That is the warning when Hanuman is there on the chariot of Arjuna. Who is the Sarathi? Lord Krishna himself. Then what is the question of defeat there? There is no यत्र रेवेश्वर कृष्णो, यत्र बाल्को धनुर्दरा, तत्र श्री विजयोगुति। This is the last shloka of Bhagavad Gita, which says, "So when Hanuman is there, there, there is no question. That's why he is living there." Atham Jyavasti Tam Rishtva Dharta Rashtra Kapit Dvaja. There is a beautiful history behind this. There is a fantastic divine story which happens here when Bhima Sena goes to get Saurabhi Kapushpa. Please, you must know this. The background here, when Bhima Sena goes to get the Saurabhi Kapushpa. On the way, Hanuman was there, lying. Okay, he he did not want to just cross over Hanuman. So his tail was also coming on the blocking, blocking the way there. Then Bhima Sena, without knowing who is that character, Hanuman. But they, even though Hanuman is nothing but Bhima Sena is nothing but the same avatar of Hanuman only. Hanuman, Bhima, and Madhva. Hanuman is in Trita Yuga, Bhima Sena in Dwapar Yuga. In this Kali Yuga, Madhva Chade. Many of no, nobody knows this. These are the three incarnations of three Yugas: Trita Yuga, Dwapar Yuga, and Kali Yuga. In the 12th century, one of the three Acharyas who came, Shankara Acharya, Ramanuja Acharya, and Madhva Chade. So Madhva Chade is the incarnation of Vayu. That is the belief what we have, and he has already proved in his life history, in his autobiography, we have seen already that he is a Vayu avatar. So Bhima Sena also, without knowing that he is why, he was not aware of that, and he just asked the Hanuman there, the monkey who was lying there, just leave the way. I am going there to get Sawan Dika Pushpa. Just leave me, leave the way. Then Hanuman says, I am very old, so why don't you please help me? Just lift that tail this side aside, and you can proceed. No, he says. So that is the ahankara what Bhima Sena has. So he says, oh. Won't you learn it? No problem. Let me just take it off. He just tries to lift that, but it it is so heavy that he he could not even shake the tail even an inch also. 
So by then he comes to know that, oh, this is someone who is very great then. When I am unable to even lift the tail of this monkey, then he should be some divine personality there. Then he folds his hand and requests that. So please excuse my ignorance there. He says, then Hanuman, being pleased there, he gives one vara there. He gives one boon to Bhimasena. He says that Hanuman, when you are going to be in the battlefield, I will be there in your Shankhanada. When you blow the Shankha, I am going to be there. My voice is also going to add into your Shankhanada there. That's why when Bhimasena made the Shankha, Bhima Karma Prabhodaraha, Poundram Dadmo Mahashankam. Please remember, go back to the few slokas back. Poundram Dadmo Mahashankam, Mahashankha it is. When he blew the Shankha, Bhima Karma Prabhodaraha, so everybody on the opposite side, they got the fear. So that's what we are. Why means? Because Hanuman said that. I am going to be there in your voice. I am going to be there in your Shankarana. And definitely I will be there on Arjuna's chariot. So this is how when Kapitvaja, that word has to be analyzed there. Dhatrashtran Kapitvaja. Pravritte Shastra Sampate Dhanurudhyamya Pandava. So this is how we need to understand each and every word. Analyze each and every word. Then what is this? Rishi Kesham Tada Vakyam Idam Aham Hipate Rishi Kesham Tada Vakyam Rishi Kesha, I already explained the meaning of that. Rishi Kesha means one who is the master of our senses. Who can be master of senses? We are definitely not our master of our senses. We are slaves of our senses, definitely. Is it not? Everyone, everyone is slave. We are Indriya Dasa. We are not Rishi Kesha. We are not the master of our senses. Because we always get completely yielded to our senses. We always completely get yielded to our senses. Demand of our eyes, demand of our ears. We are Indriya Dasas. So Rishikesha means that can be only one. That is Lord Krishna. So Rishikesha Taravakyam Idam Mahipate. Again, Sanjaya taunts Dhritarashtrate saying that Mahipati. What type of Mahipati you are? You could not control just a war there. You said that uh, I cannot control my children. Then what type of Mahipati you are? You are no more going to be Mahipati there. That is a warning message is there. So that's why again he says, Idam Aham Mahipati. Then what Arjuna says? Sena Yogurva Yogurva Madhye Ratham Sthapaya Vinchita. So he wanted to know who are all the people with whom I want to fight. So he requests Krishna there. Please Krishna, take me into the mid of the both of our armies, both the armies there. So I would like to see Senayor, Rubayor, Madhye, in exactly in the middle, you take my chariot. There, Arjuna, psychology you should see there. He doesn't request there. There is a tone of that Ahankara tone is there in Arjuna's voice. Senayor, Rubayor, Madhye, Ratham, Stavarya, Me. May, the word the may means that Ahankara is there. He is just speaking to Krishna like he is the owner of the chariot and the driver. Driver is Lord Krishna. Is it not? Like we order our drivers. Hey driver, come on, get the bag from my car. Take the park the vehicle there. We order no, to our car drivers. Like that, Arjuna is ordering Krishna there. This is the Vijankura of Bhagavad Gita. Please remember how this Bhagavad Gita Upadesha started means this is the look. Senayor Ubayor Madhye Ratham Sthapaya Me. That me means Ahankara. Me, mine, me, mera. This is the Hindi may be me. Hey, me, me, me. You have a phone call, no? Who is calling? I am calling. Me, who? Vishwika is a very proud man. I am not going to give you. I said, don't know that. अगर कोई पूछ लेता है, जब somebody ask who is that, you don't know me, it's me. That the word saying thing me, that me was there. रथम स्थाप या me चुता, ये चुता just take the vehicle and keep it in front of both the armies there. That अहंकारा स्थाप दे. Krishna understood. Oh, this person is developing very big अहंकारा दे. I need to do psychotherapy now. So this is why. We are all like Arjuna. With complete ahankara in our life. Do-chaar-shloka-chaar-liya. 
दो चार पन्ना पढ़ लिया दो चार क्लास ले लिया कोई बोलती है वाह 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 सब बोल के चला गया ऊपर चढ़ गए मेरे जैसा कोई है ही नहीं दुनिया में ये हम कहा जाता है विद्या तथा विनयम वो विनय आता ही नहीं हमको सो दिस इज वॉट हैपन्स अहंकार देन दैट टाइम फॉर अर्जुन कृष्ण वॉज दे इन आवर लाइफ इज दे वी हैव टू टेक अर्जुन कृष्ण एज अवर चैरिटियर ये रजु जो है दट्स वाई आत्मा रथिनम विद्धि शरीर रथमे वचा बुद्धि तो सारथिम विद्धि मन प्रग्रह में वचा इंद्रियाणि हयाम्याहु विषयां स्तेषु गोचरान आत्मेन्द्रिय मनोयुक्त भोक्ते इत्यावर भीषणः मनीषः दिस इज अ श्लोक फ्रॉम कठोपनिषद सो ब्यूटीफुली वी कैन कंपेयर दैट टू भगवत गीता हियर इज इट नॉट सो फॉर दैट अर्जुनास अहंकार में दैट इज द बीज बीजांगुरा फॉर दिस साइकोथेरेपी दैट इज द बीजांगुरा फॉर भगवत गीता उपदेश सो विद दिस नॉलेज लेट अस स्टॉप व्हाट हैपेंड नेक्स्ट सो दिस आई कैन प्रूव दैट Why that may is ahankara. In the other next two shlokas, that is going to explain why Arjuna got that ahankara. So that we will discuss in next time, next discussion. Till then, Hari Om Tat Sat. Om Tat Sat Soma Sarkamaya Tama Soma.